my beauties welcome back today I wanted to do a vlog again I had so much fun doing this last time that I feel like you can kind of get to know me a lot better so I am going to update you a little bit on things and just chit chat with you so stick around so today is Thursday and my son's in school and as you know the days that he's in school I feel like I have more time to more free time at least i should say when my daughter naps i get to do everything that i have to do so anyway so this week this past um weekend um my daughter madison had her one year photos which i am like so sad about happy and sad emotional you know new mom syndrome and it it they turned the pictures turned out so nice even though it was so hot out Poor girl like I thought I was gonna pass out so I'm just so happy about that but I wanted to share um, a couple of her outfits um, that I purchased for her so I first outfit is this cute little um, it's a little dress and it says one and with a little like tutu kind of bottom that that was cute and then for her photos I bought a, I bought like a couple of different outfits because I'm like well, I might have something small at the house, and I'm like, well, I might have something if I have, you know, you have to have options, right? So, and I wanted options for photos too. So here's another um, outfit. What's well, a onesie? It says it's my first birthday, and this onesie, and this onesie with a number one, and these I paired them. So I'm going to pair it with. This pretty little tutu, which she wore this for her photos, for her one of your photos. I thought, oh my gosh, that is so cute. And then I had got an extra tutu just in case. Um, this one got ruined, but it didn't. And this one's just a little bigger, but I thought, oh my god, that is adorable. And then I also got, I want to show you her cute little headpiece. I mean, how adorable is this? And it has the number one on there. Adorable. And I want to show you this pretty um, headpiece too. It's got little flowers and a number one on there. I thought, oh my gosh. It's a little crown. Adorable. So that's what she wore for her pictures. And that's what she will wear for her um, birthday. And I still haven't decided if we end up doing like a little pool party. I already have a bathing suit for her, which actually I showed it to you guys. I showed it to you in my last vlog video. And it's a little turquoisey, like mermaidy outfit. And I'm thinking of just buying like a number one and like sewing it on there or ironing it on. I'm not sure. Probably sew it on. I'm very kind of crafty DIY when it comes to those kind of things. So, and if it's a pool party. I bought like I have to show you like the plates and stuff I bought because it's the summertime. I'm gonna have to show that to you next. Just a couple of little things I've been purchasing here and there. So yeah, so if we decide to do a party for my daughter, we decided it'll be like a pool party wherever we're gonna be at and stay because we're gonna be on vacation. And I thought these were so cute. Home goods always comes through. I found these cute little plates. They're little lemons. I thought that was adorable. And I found these plates. And they have watermelon, pineapples, and flamingos. You can see that. And oh yeah, and little lemons. So it matches perfect. I thought that was cute. So I got a bunch of those. I think I got them all. And I got little ones for um, cake. And then I got, so I got a bunch of those plates because I was like, oh, they're so cute. I can even use them here at my house if I have extras. And then I bought the matching napkins. I thought they were adorable. Very summery, like uh, little lemon napkins. I thought those were so cute. So, yeah, so I just got extras because, you know. I rather have more than um, than right now, and to match her uh, outfits, I found this cute little princess banner. It's just pink and gold, and I figured I would go with this kind of theme for decorations, and with 
summery stuff too. So yeah, that's what I got at Home Goods. But today I'm going to show you what I got at Bye Bye Baby. And I got these cute little bibs because if you don't know now, you know that I'm not a go everything. I love it. This one has a cute little whale. And this one has a cute little ship wheel and it says love. And this one just has little whales. So cute. And this was $9.99. And I I wanted to get another um, sleep sack because she only has one and I've been loving them and I actually just wanted to try a different brand and this one it it just says it's from Swaddle Designs Cotton Knit Zip Me Sack um, so yeah this one was $21.99 but you do know that Bye Bye Baby um, takes the 20% off coupons so I used that for this and I just love the, the little cute design I hope you can see that. It's very white. Um, cute little flowers. It's not like bright pink, but it's like a light pink peachy. And she only has one of these, so I needed another one. And I wanted to give this a try. What else did I get? Um, Babies Are Us is having lots of sales. I told you this before in my hauls. And right now their sale items are an extra 50% off. So I wanted to get her some cute little shoes for our upcoming vacation. They're like just cute little sandals. And these were $9.98, so $10. So they were like 5 bucks. And I thought they were so cute. She has something similar that I got at Old Navy, but she's like, they're almost a little too tight on her. So she's almost outgrowing them. And these are size 4. They probably fit her a little bit big, but they are so pretty. So I got her these. And then these cute little jelly sandals, I guess they're called. And I don't think that these are good for uh, learning, babies that are learning to walk. But I think just they're so cute and stylish. And she's not even walking yet. So, you know, they're just, instead of being barefoot, um, just some cute little sandals with some cute little flower. And these were like five bucks also. So um, I thought that was cute. And then I, oh, another thing I bought by Baby, um, I have a nice giveaway. So um, I'm not sure which video will go up, this one or that one, but stay tuned for that. It's what else do I have to show you? Oh my God, I have to show you. I have to update you on so my yeah, kitchen I cabinets. I have to update you on my kitchen cabinets. The last time I told you that my kitchen cabinets were not finished and they're finally finished. Um, they were dark wood and now they're a white and it's so me i love it it's bright it's pretty it's it's very airy and i love it and cabinets I'm gonna show it look too. like i love it it this kitchen is like it's just like bright now i love it here's the island all i need now is i'm kind of shopping for the countertops and backsplash um but we do have my daughter's birthday coming and we're going on vacation august for her birthday and we're going away in september to jamaica so i might have to wait till afterwards but i definitely want to get rid of the black countertops i do not like them so it'll definitely be something lighter so that's next and what else oh let me show you in my other vlog my previous vlog, I showed you the things that I purchased at Burlington. And I want to show you where I hung so them. So I put this little frame for Ever Home. This is one that I bought um, that I showed you in my other um, vlog. I love it there. I think it's so cute. And then I ended up hanging. This wasn't my plan, but I wanted to put this little window frame on the vertically with the other because I ended up finding I didn't I don't think yeah I ended up finding the matching set and I wanted to put them like right next to each other but it they don't fit in the areas that I want to put them so anyways I ended up just hanging this one there which I still have to add pictures it still has a like, price the tag kind of person like well let me make sure that I really like it even though I've made holes in the wall you know what I mean but I do love it so I have to definitely put pictures in it and take the price tag off I'm not sure but let me show you how clean my living room is I mean it's not that bad 
I don't think it's that bad at all, actually. Not bad. So I think it's not that bad at all. Um, I've been like decluttering the kids' playroom. I'll show you a little bit. Um, I God, there's still a lot of junk in here. I tried, but I've been like decluttering and taking out toys that I'm like, okay, they haven't played with it. They don't need it. They don't use it too much stuff. And I still feel like there's still a lot of stuff. Um, I have this like train table. I feel like my son doesn't even use it. He uses this other little table in our family room and that just takes up too much space. So I might donate it or get rid of it or something. Um, so yeah, but it's, I mean, for the most part, it's pretty clean and how adorable is this little, well, now it's a little bit of a mess because I've been just piling them on there, but, um, I put all my son's projects there. They're like three shelves that I bought at home goods, which I think is a great idea. If you want to hang your kids artwork, um, they're like little shelves. And they have little clips on there. So I got three of them. One, two, three. And I just hang all his nice artwork that I wanted to keep. ended up painting these two um, rooms here. So yeah. here is my living room, formal living room or whatever you want to call it, that we um, ended up painting lighter, which I love it. It's like a nice gray. And it actually is the same gray that I have in my family room, but... It looks different in here because of the lighting I guess which always do swatches on paint because I I was like I told my painter I love that color over there so he did it here and it's a different color which it's not bad it's it's nice it's better than what it was let's just put it that way so anyways this is the area right here that I'm looking for a frame for and I still haven't had any luck but so that's why that's like that um still looking for a frame there and listen to me I just put that frame up and that frame up and I'm gonna put pictures so we're gonna get like um, family photos taken too so I'm gonna put those in there I swear I feel like this home decorating is never ending do you feel the same way like oh, my husband's like honey you're buying more stuff I'm like honey I'm not done decorating so that's now that. it's like almost two o'clock what's 1 40 madison's still napping and i'm gonna have some coffee oh my gosh so good mm. oh my gosh so these past few weeks, I want to say, have been so crazy. Um, Madison, I want to say, like, two weeks ago was very fussy. And I'm like, usually I knew now that when she's that fussy, she was definitely teething. Because when she was acting this way, she got her bottom teeth. So I'm like, she's definitely teething again. But for two weeks, I didn't sleep. And she still nurses and she has me up at night and I just feel bad because there's not much that I can do you know just I don't give her too much medicine Tylenol and this and that so um she definitely I think it was last week that I'm like wow four teeth four of her top teeth came out and I'm like poor baby no wonder she was so fussy well a couple days she was good and then again this week she's fussy so I'm not sure if it's just them still coming out or she's just going through a growth spurt or I don't know what it is and so I haven't had much sleep I feel like she just wants to be attached to me and at night nursing so for you nursing moms um like I'm like she's almost one I want to wean her off but then we're going on a couple of vacations so I'm like thinking I'll wait till after because then it'll it's like if you know she gets cranky or fussy on the plane I can nurse her and I know that that soothes her um but then I feel bad because I'm like, well, if she's not ready to wean off, then why would I just be like, sorry, we're done. You know what I mean? So ugh, I'm in limbo with that. Like my husband's like, honey, you know, you did it for a year. And oh, that's her waking up now. You did it for a year. Like that's, you know, that's really good. So you should be proud. So that's where I'm at with that. So I'm like exhausted. I'm like living off coffee. 
because it's exhausting. Being a mom is exhausting. I'm a stay-at-home mom, but um, some days are really hard. So let's go upstairs. I can hear her waking up, and I'm going to show you a couple of more things. Okay, so now I'm in my son's room. Now, for your, for those of you that know, I um, redid my son's bedroom. Well, I didn't redo it. I painted his furniture that I had, and his furniture was a dark wood. If you want to watch a couple of my previous videos, you'll know that um, his bedroom was dark. It was always nautical, but um, the furniture was a dark wood. And I just didn't like it, and I always wanted a lighter um, color. And so I ended up painting it, and I have two videos on it, one on the crib and one on the dresser, and I just want to show them, with, show them to you. That is what the crib looks like, and I love how it turned out. I just and love it. Here is his dresser, and I just love how it turned out. I am so happy. I, I am not a professional painter. Like, this is all new to me, but I thought that I can do it, and I ended up using chalk paint, and you can watch those videos um, so you can see how I did it. So, yeah, yeah I so love how have, it turned like, out. Old furniture or your wood, your crib's looking a little bit like old or scratched up or your your baby's you know bite because I know like when they're um teething they tend to bite the um the crib rail and stuff like that well the chalk paint covered all of that so I just love it I love how it turned out um so I'm going to show you a couple of more items that I purchased um for my son and I found these pants and they're like they're not sweats they're just um, pants. I thought they were perfect for school um, when it starts to get a little chilly. $5.99. I thought that was a, a good price. And then I found this um, tank top and we're, you know, still warm and it's summertime and this was $5.99. I thought that was cute. Um, a t-shirt, $6.99. Just a nice t-shirt for school or whatever. Um, Babies are, as I told you, the 50% off sale items, 50% off. I got them these um, pants, again, like loungy pants for school and stuff like that. These were $5. So I got them a blue pair, and they're thin, so they're not like thick. Just, you know, when you don't, when it's a little chilly out. So these are perfect. I got a blue one, and I got a gray one. Okay, those are five bucks. Um,. I got this super cute t-shirt, superhero loading, please wait. Um, it says it was on sale, see this pink tag, um, $3.98, 50% off that, like, hello, yes. Um, I was bummed out they didn't have many, like, much of his size, and my daughters are, I would have got more stuff, but I'm thinking of going to a different Babies R Us to see if they have stuff, so, and then, oh, this is from Burlington, too, so we're going on vacation, and I wanted to get my son, like, button down dressy button down tropical vacation tops and i got this one i thought this was so cute and it was 8.99 like really look at this if we go out to dinner at night or something like that i thought that was so cute i got that one and i got this one this one has like palm trees and it says aloha that was so cute my handsome boy and then are these from Burlington too. These were $9.99, but again, it's that like fabric, like thin fabric. Um, these are perfect for school, lounging, when I don't want them to wear thick sweats. I thought these were perfect and he doesn't have these, so um, that's why I got these for him. Um, so yeah, that's what I got for him. Oh, and I forgot about this. Um, one of my strollers, my light strollers, the pads are not very cushiony. So I got this for my daughter. Um, and these were $3.99 for Ellington. But it was so cute design. And this one. So now that my daughter's awake, let's go and get her. And I want to show you what I got her. Let me see if I can bring you along like this. Hi, Madison. Hi, baby. <laughs> Who's so happy? Who's so happy, baby? Who's so happy? Come here, mama. How was your 
your nap, sweetie pie. Yeah, mommy was able to eat lunch, clean a little bit. Yeah. Say hi, Madison. Say hi. Say hi. Okay, so I'm going to show you what I got her. A little too bright, but anyways. So this, if we end up having the pool party, like I said, this is a bathing suit she's going to wear. I showed this last time. And I was just thinking of adding a, like, number one on there, like sewing it on or something like that. Um, so what I got her was, can I do this baby holding you? I got these at, actually no, this is from Burlington, two little pants, I thought they were cute. I like these when she, if like all her pajamas are dirty or she can sleep in these with the onesie or even just to go out in. I found this cute little pajama, it was $6.99. But the design was very cute. What else did I get? Um, I got her these little cute pants. And these were on sale for $4. And then these are just like recent buys that I got recently. And Gap's having a sale too. And where's the tag? Where's the tag? $14.99 and 50% off. And this is so cute. It says gap on there it's pink zipper yeah this is for you this is for you for the winter time where is your baby zara stuff that i bought you let me see these are one of the pants that i got from the baby zara sale she wore them yesterday it's got the cute little flamingo and i think these were like three bucks uh -huh. or maybe less i don't know something like that Um, what else? I don't know. I don't know what other stuff is. Babies. I thought I had the babies or other stuff here. Anyways, so what else? So I did do a, a, a room, nursery room tour a while back, but I wanted to show you like a couple of things that I recently purchased. And one of them is that beautiful little lamp there. And it's a little carriage and it's pink. And that is from Home Goods. And I just put a cute little frame here of Madison. That's her. I love it. So that's that. I actually painted this table too. I know. I'm on like a painting kick. Um, that was a dark wood table. And I painted it white. And I painted that the same as my um, dining room table, which there's a video the of. Little um, clothing rack on that side. That's what I did. I moved the clothing rack on this side. And I'll show you what's on this side now. Yeah, that's good. And then I ended up putting her changing table over here. And I just always take out stuff out of her crib because I don't like her sleeping with stuff in her crib. But um, can you see that? Yeah, you can. Okay, so here's the changing table I put it over here and you can see the little frames are still up and this is just a pretty frame of her pictures that I took of her when she was one month old oh so cute and I don't know I was gonna be in the picture but the lady was like oh just get in it you look fine I'll make it black and white and I'm like well I wish I would have known I was gonna be in it I would have looked prettier and done my hair but whatever and then I got this little thing and this is her like keepsake box. So, oh look at these. These are new socks too that I got. Um, $2.99. They're just cute little pink socks. So that's that. And now we're gonna go downstairs and feed little Mrs. Princess Madison something to eat. You hungry? Can you say hi? All right, so we're gonna go downstairs, finish my coffee, and feed her.
She's like, come play with me, mommy. All right, so that's that. What else do I have to show you? I love this. I feel like I'm talking to my friend. Oh. Mm. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm, t oh my God, how cute is this mug? But first, coffee. Um, home goods. It's always either Home Goods, Marshalls, Burlington, TJ Maxx. Those are all my stores. And what are you doing, Madison? So, yeah, I just, I actually love these videos. I feel like I can give you, like, life update. And um, I feel like I'm talking to my friend. And, yeah, so now I'm going to end the vlog with this pretty little girl. Yeah, hi, mama. Right, baby? And we are just going to eat. I think we're going to eat and play and maybe do a couple of errands so that's it thank you so much for watching and i'm not sure if this video is going to go up before um my other video that i did on a diaper bag on the honest company um backpack diaper bag and i have a giveaway on that video so if you are a subscriber please don't forget to like comment and subscribe if you're not and so you can enter this giveaway thank you so much for watching ladies until next time bye say bye mama are you saying bye are you saying bye <laughs>